Good time zone everyone, I'm Bagatrix, your story playing adventurer, and welcome back to Fairy Tale. Did you know that you could pose all of your favorite characters from Fairy Tale for an in-game photo shoot? No? Cause neither did I. So get fired up and don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave your favorite fairy tale arc in the comments below. There we go. So this is how we get the majority of our staff to level up, I suppose. Um, that one's just beach, secure beach, subdue, subdue, subdue. These guys are new. 20 Flutterer. Let's see how much more powerful the things in the Great Plains are when we use a B level quest. Be aggressive. Be, be aggressive. I, I hit the attack button. Attack buttons no work, apparently. All right, so Lucy Kick, level 12. They're still not that more powerful. I thought they'd be stronger than this. Well, this will be an easy mop up then. Almost level 24. So close. So close I can taste it. I can smell the fire on Nazi's breath. Oof. You know you're sad when Lucy almost one hits you. Also, I just realized that Lucy is the fastest character in the entire party, I think. Level 24 for Natsu. Does he get a new spell? He does. A mega Fire Dragon Horn. Dragon Sword Horn. That's a mouthful. Yes. So, two, four, six, eight, maybe? I don't know. I'm about to look at what her speed is. <laughs> Poor 6,000 damage. And yeah, the amount of XP we get for these is negligible at best. What is her stats? Alright, so speed, 170. Ah, uh, she, she's above everybody by leaps and charms. More than likely, yep, because of her lacrima. Bag, trife, my friend, my man, welcome home. How you doing today? Yes. How have you been? Have you gone through and done fairy tale yet? If you have, what do you think? Been doing well. How you how you oh, how you liking this game? You have it, but you have to finish P3 first. Okay, that's fair. So I will say that if you're a fan of fairy tale, definitely something to pick up. However, it's not perfect. There are, there are so many little things that that just feel lazy about it. That's the best way to describe it. However, it's still fun, and, and that I think is probably one of the more important things. You know what I mean? You might be disappointed by some of the little things that they chose not to do, or that they were lazy about, but at the end of the day, I'm not having a bad time playing it. Alright, so this... If I had... Oh, if I had any gumption, I'd actually be able to do that. Oh, well. Gotcha. I mean, if the gameplay's fun, it'll draw me in. I'm kind of liking these costumes. Oh, these, these costumes, you say? Costumes. Oh, hold on. Wait a second. Speaking of. Yeah, all right. So, costume for Lucy. Um, Gray. Well, nobody cares about Gray. <laughs> Juvia cares about Gray. I don't care about Gray. But, but check this out. So you can you can now do this. You can toy with a little bit. You can do character mode. You can put uh, different poses. <laughs> I 
uh, with, with, with Lucy. You can make her like a freaking rotating statuette. You can, you can have her happy. Angry. Oh, oh, angry is how we get so... Oh, my God. And it actually has physics. <laughs> I don't I don't even know why. <laughs> why was this angry? How was this angry? <laughs> Surprised. Okay, that's that's fair. No shame. No shame whatsoever. This actually gives you a good comparison as to uh, what her 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 particular plot standing is. And and pose one. Pose pose two. <laughs> uh, why is there a bikini emote, Forbes? You know, surprised they didn't, you know, censor more of that. But they censored more of that, but they censored other things. Yeah, right? Right? And then uh, battle pose, victory pose, yep. Combat pose. She apparently does karate. <laughs> battle pose too. Oh my god, she's about to use a freaking Gallic gun. I know it. Alright, so battle pose three, battle pose four, as she's dude, mid figurine. This is something you could just make a figurine of and post it up in your bedroom. But yeah, alright, so Lucy Lou. Erisa. Oh, hold on. Uh Avatar Select, yes. On. <laughs> Wait, wait a second. Holy crap, you can have more than one. <laughs> you can make your own panorama. Oh, wait a second. Hold hold the phone. And you can change their um Wait, 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 wait a second. So you can you can make them like this and and like uh like like that. You know? It's Senran Kagura all over again. Did they actually have a feature like this in Senran Kagura? Because I don't know. All right. Oh, so pure, so innocent. All of her. Look now, that's that's an angry face. Okay, that that is how you do angry, Lucy. Can, can we can we get demonstration, Lucy? This is this is not how you do angry. How how is that angry? Okay, how is that angry? Hey bag, I'm in chat. I'm heading. Take it easy, Richard. Have a great night. Sleep well. Holy balls. What time is it anyway? Oh, jeez. Anyway, they did, and people got really creative. Oh boy. Do I even want to know? Ah <sighs> The internet. The internet. Yeah, it's a dressing room. They removed it in uh, Sanran because, you know, you could grow up the girls. <laughs> what? Holy balls. And so, summon Leo. You know, Sony being Sony. I mean, to be fair, to be fair... The head padding feature was removed from, uh, what was it again? Hold on, wait, pentagram sword. Hmm. 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 Head padding feature is removed from Fire Emblem, which Fire Emblem? And that's, that's a Nintendo decision. See, I'll be moving around as the uh, as the ladies who you play because you know it's crazy. You can't stand One Piece designs, but you love fairy tale designs, really. So, what turns you off about the One Piece designs, and how do you not like Nami? Nami and uh, Nico Robin, or 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 what about what about the lovely and wonderful personality personality because she has lots of plot. Um, Boa Hancock. Dude, Lucy almost actually KO'd then. Nice. Exactly, lots of plot and Rosario. I totally forgot to remove that the emote and turn it around. 
but uh, way too lanky and their heads and faces are weird to you. Okay, all right, I gotcha. I mean, fairy tale is more anatomically correct if you want to be real. One Piece has its own art style. Oh, we'll go ahead and do that. Urza, go for it. <laughs> Vorbs. There you go. Rosario fixed it for me. Mirror the uh, the email. I, I will fix it so you guys don't have to pay to, to actually mirror the email. There we go. But it's really weird having watched the art style evolve over time for One Piece because so many different characters have very unique and distinct art styles. And the giants specifically have a have a laugh that, that makes them them. Like every particular giant character has a or you know <laughs> or something. It's just it's kind of cool. Like, it's what makes them, them. But that's neither here nor there. I mean, some of the other characters have their own specific last two, but hey, it's a, it's a thing. It's a thing. Mm. All right. I think we might end up being done with uh, this and just go straight into the Grand Magic games because I want to see some of that before we go for the evening. It's too late for you to get into One Piece. One of my good friends has been trying for years. <laughs> Honestly, I got into One Piece when I was in high school. Okay, and at that point, at that point, me and my sister found it, and we actually had to watch the first, like, 200 episodes off of a Chinese bootleg. Off of a Chinese bootleg. <laughs> and when we watched it, we, we took, like, two days of our, no, actually, it was like, it was like three or, three or four days of our lives where we did nothing but eat, sleep, and one piece. That was that was our entire week, basically. And then we sent the videos back to the video store. Mm. And I will tell you something, though. Those subtitles are horrible. <laughs> They're so bad. They're absolutely the worst. Uh, were they English subs or were you just watching it in Chinese? Oh, there were there were English subs. But the uh, the subs for English were were subtitled by somebody who knew English as a second or third language, so you can imagine the subtitles weren't that great. Ooh, the true level is so. Then what we were using before. Devil this, uh, do something, whatever words. Le French whip. Uh, how many more do we have to kill? I guess this is why it's a B rank quest. Need one more flutter. Here we go. Do we have a line attack? Lucy does not have a line attack. Yikes. Uh, Photon Slicer does, though. Go, go, Urza Photon. Let's make you evolve. We can go ahead and kill that. Why not? Yo, Sub-Zero Smoke Rain. Good to see you. Welcome home. How you doing today? It's been a hot minute. Hope you're doing good. 
All right, pour it back, turn this in, see what we get for it, and see if it's a lot more than what we're used to. Quest complete. Ooh, nice bonds. Gives us a plus 80. So we're like 50% into that. All right, let me let me go back to um to Magnolia and see if we have any particular bond sections that we can do. Alright, so do we have any? The answer is no. Okay, that's fine. Um, the one thing I did want to do is make some more lacrima. Synthesize. Uh, curse lacrima, no fear, no. Ah, here we are. So this, the chipped fang, is what we wanted to make. I think we needed a chipped fang from, oh. We need chipped fangs from, uh, from these. Crap. This is important, though. I might go back and do that real quick. How am I doing, Tricks? Oh, I'm doing all right. You know, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. Trying to freaking go through and destroy everything in the forest. He's been a pastime of mine. Uh, Golem and five wizardmen. Ten the beast and ten siren. That's, that's a much easier request. Let's go ahead and do that. And then we'll take that since we need the beast anyway for the chip fangs. This is actually straight following the story from Fairy Tale or is it its own thing? It is actually straight up following the story for Fairy Tale. Oh, hold on, wait a second. Can we can we get you to follow? We do have our uh yes, it's in range! I wonder if we can actually break it. Let's try this. Hopefully we can get lucky and end it with an extreme magic. Alright, alright, alright. We're at 6,000. Come on, give us another extreme magic when we get to a certain point. So they're 13,000. 16,000. Crap, we didn't get it. Oh no, we were so close, yet so far. If we had gotten one of them with the extreme magics at the very end, we would have actually done it. You know, wait a second. Oh, but we've used all of our things. We'll, we'll, we'll come back after we're done. But yes, just showing everything is my usual plan of action. If it fails, well, it usually doesn't fail, except when you don't do enough damage, right? The game style is great. There, there are things that I have issues with, though. One of the which is that they choose not to animate certain characters, and all they are is a floating head, like a text, um, like a, a character's portrait. Which actually kind of bugs me. Because it comes off as just being lazy. And some of the summons aren't animated. There's only like three of them that are animated. Y you'd have to see it. No English job? Ah, uh, no, there's no English job. And, and personally, I'm kind of of the eh about English dubs anyway. I listen to everything in Japanese, or even if it's not like uh, an anime. Like if I'm watching a foreign TV show, I usually watch it in, in whatever language it was recorded in. Fairy tales, good English dubs, but are they Full Metal Alchemist good English dubs? Where I legitimately didn't mind listening to it. 
You felt like red in Final Fantasy VII. And remake, what, what? What do you mean you feel like red? Oh, you felt like that with the red in Final Fantasy VII? Like they didn't do enough with that character? Well, that's because his time has yet to come. I can't wait. Can't wait to see what he does in Cosmo Canyon. Like, the, the entire story, I feel like, is going to be a lot more fleshed out. Hopefully. If, if it's any indication what they did so far, then we should have a good time with Ren. Cosmo Canyon, right? I, can, you, can you imagine all those scenes? It's not as good, but it's one of the few Americanized uh, Japanimations with... Wait, that you actually watched English jobs? Hmm. I mean, that in and of itself is a testament. Alright, um... No, 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 no. Where you at? I wanted to see if I couldn't, like, cheese that, but whatever. Hmm. There's one of those ship fangs I needed. Yeah, we're not going to fight any of those ridiculously strong ones. Let's kill ourselves a few sirens. I feel like Gadgil is an easier character to do than Natsu. Because if you if you had to get the voice pitch right, like Gadgil is uh is something that's it's not too bad. Or not too too hard. <laughs> yeah, stay away from the Super Saiyan beast right now. <laughs> oh man. You think Roni Kenshin and Yu Hakusho, but uh, it's it's dubbed. Mm, it's subbed in general for your opinion. So so whenever you think about that though, uh, I would say that Roni Kenshin and Yu Yu Hakusho were probably some of the first animes I ever watched as a kid. So I didn't know what the the other voices sounded like, and so having heard the English voices growing up, going back and watching it in Japanese just feels odd. Do you know what I mean? Nedge, good to see you. Welcome home. It's good to see you this fine evening. You're up late. Mm. Finally, all right. We have our limit break back. Exactly like that, Trix, right? I mean, honestly, I can't I can't think of going back and listening to Yu Yu Hakusho with uh, the main character is as anything but the English voice. It would just feel odd. Out of place. Yeah, it's about time for you to turn into a pumpkin. I thought that was normally like about 9.30 when you hit pumpkin status. 10 o'clock, you've become a full-blown pumpkin. And around 11, you start making pumpkin spice lattes. <sighs> no. <laughs> Kurabara's English voice is, you know, forever you. Really? I can, I can agree with that. Who else is he, like, uh, voice? That particular voice actor, though. Ooh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Where is the one? Ah, so that needs 30,000. That has a crate behind it. Let's see if we can't coax somebody over here, shall we? We got it. Hold on. Let's see if we can't line this puppy up. So he he did Vegeta, Piccolo, and Zoro. No wonder. All right. I was like, who is it? All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. Did we get somebody else? It'll be 25,000, 30,000, here we come! Good old Urza. Nice, 40,000 damage total, and we get to break the rock behind it, giving us access to what's behind that nice looking crate and loot. Night Night Omega, anyway man, you have a great screen, it's bedtime for you, you were up at 4, you were up at 4 a.m. to get to work, jeez. Take it easy. Have a great night. Thank you so much for stopping in. When you had a moment, sleep well, my friend. 
Hold on, wait a sec. You. It's back here. Nope. Um. Nope. Freaking hell. <laughs> Where was the rock that I just broke? 5v2 every day. Oof. That's a bit rough. Dude, we're almost about to hit level 25. That's how long we've been out messing around. Ah, uh, here we go. Bink! More delicious candy. We have four on the hand. Um, hmm. So there is one more rock that we have to try to break. I wonder, can you just defend? You can just defend, right? And then, like, would would she just straight up kill it with the photon slicer? No, she doesn't. Oh, good to know. Good to know. All right, so I'll just go ahead and smack it in the face. And then we can uh, mega horn. Twenty-five for Natsu. Nice, new magic, new magic, new magic, Lakrima equipment slot unlocked. That is actually super friggin' useful. Mm, there it is. Flame amulet, inflicting burn on an enemy. Let me, let me see. Yeah, I mean, we can do that. Why not? So he has mind... Mind, Wizard, Flame, and Protection Charms. And we don't need you anymore. But if we can get the Wizard Gauge or the Fairy Gauge to fill up the rest of the way, we could have a good time. Who's left? You. <laughs> there we go. Hard to never use regular attacks, but you know what? I felt like clubbing something to death. She was a she was a good example. Urza should finish this off, hopefully. Very nice. I do enjoy the fact... Oh, there we are. Nice and done. Um, So that one's done. So we need beasts. And then we can hopefully get the one that's way over there. Oh, heck no, we're not doing that. So then what one's over here? Oh, two normal ones. Nice. Hey, buddy. Yeah. That's three. That makes us um, six done. This is actually perfect. I can give it um, Urza to finish him off. Blooming blood. And this way, if it doesn't get finished off, we can go ahead and have Lucy finish it as well. I lied. That would not finish it off. But it still is amusing to have Lucy kick things for no reason. Oh, nice. We got our big one. Um... Photon Slicer. And you can totally finish this off. Oof. Dude, it's two behind. Oh, that's no fair. 
Why did it have to be so far away? Uh, we have no way to actually do this. Nice. Nice. Easy enough, though. Alright, so we can go ahead and give another try to that boulder that was sitting way at the beginning. See if we can actually break it with 30,000 damage. And grab the other uh, tasty candy or something that's like that. So what we need to do is make sure that we have that in the background. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on. You stop chasing me. Thank you. Yes. Yes, there we go. Yes. All right, let's give it a try. Dude, already dead. Please give us a nov. I'm gonna take the chance. Combo bonus. Please. Damn it, only 17. I should have taken the extreme magic. We failed. Shoot. Well, that is disappointing. All right, we need three more beasts to get out of here. <sighs> I think these will be the last couple we need right back here. Yes. Yare, yare. I'm what the opposite of extreme magic would be. Um, simp magic, weak, weak magic. I don't know what I mean. Simple magic, right? Right. Very nice. Uh, Ice Mick, Excalibur. Dude, we don't even need that. Can we have something that does... Um... Ah, there we go. Very nice. That was two. We just need one more. Oh, actually, no, it was one. We need three total. Please be two. Nope, it's just one. Shoot. Where am I going to find the last beast? Oh, Pentagram Slasher should be able to finish it. I lied. Punch it in the face, please. Punch it in the face again. Hey, Urza at level 25. Nice. New Lacrima slot and a new skill as well. Low HP equals high attack. Raises own demon plus uh, dark elemental resistance. Hmm. So if you use it when she's almost dead. But then it also gets the bonuses of her being almost dead. Because she gets like um, attack and defense bonuses from that. So that's interesting. Lacrima of the Night, Flame Amulet, Poison Amulet, Mine, Protection Amulet. Ha oh, ha, oh, like she needs it. But as she has the, the, the Attraction Amulet as well, giving her the additional defense will make her more than a force to be reckoned with. Jeez. Hmm. I'm okay with that. So then are any of these? No, they're all they're all high level. I don't think we're gonna be able to take out any of these. I'm about to give this a try out of sheer desperation for not having any other enemies to fight. Let's let's give this a try. Let's go ahead and save. Yes! 
Let's see how badly this is going to end. Ooh, they didn't... Oh, it's not an outright kill. That's that's good. At the same time, I'm probably going to use this to heal her instead. That was a full thousand HP heal. Nice. Alright, uh, photons level 50. Oh. Um, right. Let's see how much damage we can actually do. <laughs> I'm running away. <laughs> Holy crap, man. Yeah, let's let's not do that. Let's 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 pretend that we didn't do that. But we didn't die in one hit anymore. Versus level 50, so that's that's actually kind of cool. Um, all right. Magic. And we also I guess we're gonna have to leave and come back. So that way we can actually have something to kill. Oh. Because that's what we need for that. Let me make sure. First and foremost, we can probably give it one more try. And this time, I guess, if Extreme Magic pops up on the scale, we'll give it a try. Even though I really didn't want to waste it. Yes! Yare, yare. Odemashika. All right, summon Leo, nice. They were actually lined up for once. Ooh, very nice. All right, she doesn't have any more MP, but she has enough just to be able to take him out, so that's fine. Level 25 for Lucy. Another Lakrima slot also unlocked. Um, what do I have that I can actually give Lucy? Hmm. Let me think about that. Alright, double the quest. Yep. Quest complete. 14,000 jewel. Do we have any more uh, bonds? No, I think that pretty much covers it. All right, character rank up. We have 160. We can go ahead and put uh, Gray up higher, or we can put Lucy up higher. Hmm. All right, bedtime. Have a good stream. Take it easy, Nedge. It's always wonderful to see your face. Have a great night. When attacked, 5% chance of clothes coming off and raising attack by 10% for the rather rain during the battle. Let me go ahead and do that real quick. Level 5, level 6 for Gray. Level 6, rank 6. Okay. Right, hold on a sec. You, you. And you, laboratory, we're going to synthesize us. Lacrima of the fire drink. Do we really, we really didn't get the last chipped fang we needed? The last chipped fang. That's all we needed. And we couldn't get it? Well, that That's a travesty. We're going to go fix that right now. We need at least one compliant enemy. No, no, I'm going to save you. But the beast is what drops the chip fangs. Yes! Yare, yare. Hmm. Itai wa yo. 
I just want to have that particular one before we go into uh, all of Natsu's stuff. Mm, you, Infinity Sword, Pentagram Sword. Nice. Now give us a Chip Fang. Chip Fang? No, hey, we got Ice Make Shield Unlimited. Uh, goes up to level two. Nice. Chip Fang! Yes! Alright, and now we can attempt to do the uh, the break on the boulder one more time. Last time. Come on. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. And then we're going to break. Alright, let's hope. Come on. I'm gonna I'm gonna hope that it still shows up again. Give me another extreme. There we go. That's fifteen thousand and we didn't get it? Shoot. Really? It just really doesn't like me. <laughs> like why? All you had to do was give me what I wanted so we can break the freaking boulder. But no. All right, so we'll go ahead and make the uh, the additional lacrima for Natsu, and then we should be able to to go to Lucy's house and make the other thing as well, or at least uh, check out to see what the medals are at. Heck, we're already here. Lucy's house, it is. If you want to see more videos like this one, hit the thumbs up and subscribe, and I'll see you next adventure.